The ending. Why? Why is the ending always sad? There's never like a happy ending in these romantic films. Okay, let's talk about the film. Um, the film itself is very romantic. Um, I, I like the, the whole army um, scenario there. And everything is very... Um, very well placed. Well paced also. So the, the story tells itself. It's, it's very romantic. But there are some loose strings that doesn't satisfy me with that ending because she left everything for him she left everything for him and he had nothing and, and he started having love right and then at the end he dies and all her sacrifice and all his sacrifice was basically for nothing because they couldn't be together i know um romeo and juliet tragic romantic ending i i know that it's supposed to be like a tragic romance ending but i never like to romanticize tragedy you know what i'm saying i know that many people will disagree with me and will say this is a beautiful ending but tragedy is never beautiful at the end of the day he's dead she's alone of course he cleaned his name, he's a martyr, but he's still dead. Do you know what I'm saying? It, it, they never lived their romantic story. They they lived a period of it. They it, it, It's just a tragic ending. And because this is not a true story, the writers have full control of the story. So, of course, we can't always have a happy ending in a movie, but why not right why not why why not <laughs> why did they have to die oh man i think everything in this movie was very nice but i don't like the ending because um of the loose strings they didn't stay together um the traitor was released instead of him he saved the girl and he didn't get any honor for that um like it it all went wrong you know it all went wrong in the end so it, it feels it, it for me it doesn't feel like a satisfying ending because they were going to the right direction it's like like a, a football game the guy dribbles everyone he dribbles he makes this beautiful play and at the end instead of you know scoring the goal he kicks it outside. It's, it's just not satisfying. Like, we want to see the goal, uh, in my case. But I'm a foreigner, so I'm not used to tragic endings, you know. Um, we always want happy endings. But um, I think the music is beautiful here. I think their chemistry is beautiful. But the ending, for me, I, 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 I agree that there are some movies that need a tragic ending. But I don't think this movie needed a tragic ending. I don't think it was necessary. Normally, a tragic ending is to make a very impactful um, story. But this movie has an impactful story. And the tragic ending was not necessary for that. I don't think so. It, it's like they were working towards a project. And at the end... The project never came to life, which was the project of their life, their romantic relationship. It's just a sad ending. So, ah, man, man. Okay, so we have someone who agrees. I agree with you about the ending. I didn't like the ending too much, but it made me so emotional. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I am emotional, but in the sense of frustration. Ah, I'm frustrated because... It, it feels like the enemy won. It feels like the traitor won. Of course, he, he, he ended his own life after that. But still, he he had it easy. You know what I'm saying? He, he, he got away with it. Instead of him living his life, you know, with the pain and the burden, he, he took the easy way out. 
No, he should have been imprisoned for the rest of his life. Vishnu should have suffered more and not just easily, you know, got away with it. Um, but it had a lot of plot twists. That's 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 a good thing. Um, ah, but the ending, oh man, the ending. But that's a good thing also. I'm not I'm not criticizing the film. I'm just saying that. It's such a powerful ending that it makes you like me i'm talking about it so much now because i wanted to see a happy ending and at the end i, I i'm just i'm just sad like but that's a good thing about um great movies like even in jersey that film is also i think telugu films love making us suffer you know you know um and it's it's something that it makes you talk so i think the the director and the script writer they they did what they wanted to do they got me on edge i wanted it to be a happy ending it wasn't a happy ending i'm frustrated because i wanted more of the romantic scenes and but still he died as a martyr um there are a few things that i still also don't understand um so he was imprisoned and then after eight months, he wrote his last letter to Sita. He gave the letter to the the, the commander. What was his name again? Um, he, he, to the commander. The little girl, Fajita, Wahita, took the letter from his hand. Why wasn't that letter sent immediately? Why did they wait for the girl to grow up 20 years later? Because um, her friend, when she gave, when he gave the letter to Sita, he said, um, "Ram has been waiting for you like for twenty years, something like that." Um, and then when she received the letter, she was already it was twenty years past. Do you understand what I'm saying? The little girl waited to grow, become you know the 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 commander. He waited for his granddaughter to grow become a lady and then give her the the letter why didn't he just do it immediately why did he have to wait 20 years that's what that's what like confused me at the end you know because he 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 has been from what i understand he has been dead for like 20 years the little girl said bye to him while he was going to his death and then she went to high school she grew up she went to london she was old and her well not old but she was an adult when her grandfather gave her the letter and then she started this quest you know what i'm saying that's what i'm saying um <laughs> in any case guys <laughs> oh man it's a sad ending but hey it's a beautiful film i think this um um this movie it it shook so many people I know that I'm not the only one who got affected and emotional and frustrated and uh, anxious. I, I, I know that this touched many people. And I, I know that there are some people who love tragedy, tragic endings. And I know some people who would love to see a happy ending. I'm on this side. I wanted to see a happy ending on this side. I'm on this side. I wanted to see a happy ending. There are some films that I prefer a tragic ending. But there are some films that I prefer the happy ending. And this is the type of movie that I would prefer a happy ending. Um, but hey, maybe there could be a, a, a Sita Raman 2 where, um, you know, conspiracy, the, you know, Ram at the last moment, because we didn't see him die. We didn't see him die. We just saw him with a shadow of a, a, of a rope. But we didn't see what happened next. So maybe... There could be a Sita Raman 2, where we see more of their romantic, and she finds out that he isn't dead, and I don't know. Ah. Anyways, guys, it was it was great. It was a great film, but the ending, I'm just sad. Anyways, guys, thank you for watching. Let me know what I should react to next. Let me know your thoughts about this film. 
and I guess I'll see you on the next video. Now you can get full and... access to exclusive content, special reactions to shows, series, anime, full movies, and even request a video of your choice. Just become a YouTube member or join Buy Me A Coffee today. Find out more, the link is in the description. Never break, always fight, never quit, do it right, play the game.